What if you could play your favorite PlayStation 2 games on your Android device, anywhere, anytime? Sounds too good to be true? Well, today I'm going to show you how to make it a reality with EtherSX2 emulator. Let's begin. Before we start, get these below things. EtherSX2 APK, PS2 BIOS and PS2 game file. BIOS should be around 4 megabytes. Make sure you are using your own legally obtained BIOS. Once you have the EtherSX2 APK, install the app on your Android device. After installation, launch EtherSX2. Now click on Next. Again Next. Here select Optimal Safe Defaults if you have a high-end device. Otherwise select Fast Unsafe Defaults. Click Next here for now. We will import BIOS and game later. Once this is done, now download a PS2 game you want to play. I have downloaded God of War 2. This is the BIOS file. This is our game file which is in .zip format for now. Let's convert it into .iso format first because EtherSX2 supports only .iso format file. For that, you will need ZArchiver APK. You can install it from the Play Store. Now open the ZArchiver app and go to the download folder. Click on the game file and then click on the extract here button. The extraction has started. Let's jump in the video to save time. Now the extraction has completed. Now go back to EtherSX2 again and click here to add game directory. Create a new folder by clicking here. Name it as you like. Now click on use this folder button and allow it. Now go to the file manager app where the extracted game file is located and move this .iso file in newly created folder as showing on screen. Now go back to EtherSX2 emulator and click here again. Here is our game file. Now click on this button and allow it to add the game file successfully. Now click on game file here. This pop-up will appear. It's time to add BIOS. Click on yes button here and locate the BIOS file which is in download folder. Import this BIOS file. The BIOS has imported successfully. Let's click on game file again. The game started running fine. Now you can start playing. EtherSX2 offers excellent performance and compatibility, so you can enjoy your favorite PS2 games on your Android device. If you encounter any issues during setup or gameplay, let me know in the comments section. That's it for today's tutorial on setting up EtherSX2 emulator on Android. If you have any questions or feedback, please leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more gaming content and tutorials. And if you want the best settings for this emulator, watch this video. See you there.